Hello, my name is Amy and I'm part of the Hope Church congregation, in fact, based at St Luke's in Bromley Borough. But right now, I'd like to welcome you to the Food Hub, which is based in Hope Church, Orpington. And as you can see around you, what would normally be an area that on a Sunday morning is used by the children and throughout the week is used for all kinds of community events and fun stuff has been turned into what is basically storage for an awful lot of food. We're working here as part of the TBB, which is Transform Bromley Borough. Transform Bromley Borough is a group of churches from all denominations who are working together in order to support and to serve our community, Bromley. And this is just one project of many that TBB are involved in and are supporting. But here at the hub in Orpington, as well as being TBB, we are also working alongside many other groups and individuals from Bromley, regardless of their faith. Because here, our aim is to provide food to anyone who needs it, especially at this difficult time when so many are struggling in different ways because of the COVID-19. And we are growing so quickly. The news is spreading fast and in fact, it's taking over. It's, it's going much faster and growing much quicker than we were expecting. And in a sense, we're sort of chasing ourselves a little bit to keep up. It's very, very exciting. We're getting more people offering us food and so we're having more deliveries arriving. Also, because more people are coming, becoming aware of our service here, then they're getting in touch with us and then we're being able to give, give food out to more areas in Bromley. And we've just had to invest, just literally today, we've put in two new fridges on top of the upright that we already had. We've put in an additional freezer in, as well as the big chest freezer we already had because we're needing more capacity. And our vision really is that here we are just the throughput so people can come they can collect and then take the food back to their communities in Bromley and then hand it out there to those that need it most and long term well who knows where we'll end up but our vision is to share and to give food to anyone who needs it regardless and we know that there will be those in need across our borough even after life gets back to some kind of a new normal as we're calling it so thanks for having a look. I hope you enjoy the clips and the videos that you're seeing. If you want to know more, please get in touch with Julian and we'll have his details put up on the, under my, here somewhere, I should think at some point. <laughs> uh, we just want to bless our community and bless Bromley. We have a video clip from Richard Mills in Orpington and Pete Harwood in West Wickham about food deliveries. Hi, I'm Richard. I'm from the Orpington congregation. And I just want to share with you uh, some of the things that happened when my wife Sarah and I distributed 150 meals last Friday and Saturday. It was really great. We spoke to a couple of people in a petrol station. One was a nurse, one was a carer, and they just couldn't believe that we were giving out free meals. They're absolutely amazed, couldn't believe it, wanted to know why we were doing it. It's a great opportunity to share about the things that Hope Church are doing and the things that God is doing through this corona thing. Another story I want to tell you is through another friend, we were given details of a lady who was very vulnerable. She'd found our friend up and said, where is God in the coronavirus? A few hours later, we turn up on her doorstep with some free mails saying, this is where God is. He's right here. He's given you a gift. He wants to bless you. She was totally blown away. If you get the chance to do it, it is absolutely awesome. There's such an opportunity to speak to people, to share the gospel, to share the love of God. And if this happens again, try and beat me to be first in the queue. Have a great time. Thanks. When I heard there were 3,000 meals that were going to be delivered to us at Hope, I knew it was an all hands on deck moment. Uh, so I went over to Goodmead uh, and the guys were keen to give me as many meals as I could take. So I ended up with uh, 220 meals in the back of my car. 
when I got back home, I set up a stall on my driveway so that neighbours and others from the congregation could come and collect. And uh, it was amazing. Uh, within a couple of hours, they were all gone. Uh, people from Hope West Wickham would come and deliver them to their neighbours, people who had been burgled, people with newborn babies, uh, vulnerable people, the elderly, um, and just people they wanted to bless. Uh, it was brilliant. Lots of my neighbours came and picked up meals as well. Um, and what was brilliant was that um, my WhatsApp group that we set up for our street, um, one of the neighbours is a police officer. And uh, she said, if you've got any meals left over, uh, I'd love to take some in for my colleagues at the station. And uh, actually, all the meals went with lots of other people. Um, so I went back to Goodmead and got some more and was able to give her a box of 32 meals to take into Brixton Police Station the next day. And uh, apparently they all went down really well. Uh, the police officers were really thrilled with them. They enjoyed them and they were really touched and thankful um, at this gesture. Um, I'm just going to say personally, I'm so thrilled that um, at Hope Church, we are making such a difference in a practical way to those in our communities. And we want to share not only good things for people's bodies, but good, pe good things for people's hearts, to share the love of Jesus. And that is what underpins everything we're doing here. That we want people to know that they are loved by our loving Father God. And that by doing this small act, that we are showing some of his love in action. Thank you.